Chinese Americans have a unique perspective on the pandemic with family facing the virus in China before it hit here at home. Photojournalist Steve Redland shows us how many people are giving back to help health care workers and our vulnerable populations here in Portland. My name is Bailey and I work in Intel. And I'm the program manager for the West Coast Handmade Mask. Chinese Americans in Portland have a unique perspective on the coronavirus. Their families and friends in China were the first in the world to face it. This all start with the Providence Hospital in Seattle area was calling for a hundred million and made a mask to help with the health provider in the medical mask shortage during the COVID-19 outbreak. My name is Chishen Jin. My friends and colleagues always get, call me a nickname. Chewy. <laughs> my parents are back in China, my in-laws are in China, and they are hugely impacted by this coronavirus. Our community wants to be part of this fight, and, uh, and I believe that everybody should step up. I kick off a mask sewing program to synergize the local Chinese American community to the urgent call. Within one day, we have more than 200 people join. This is a mask with a black pattern. And uh, we have the spring colors and the different fashions from our artists. This mask holds the N5 mask inside the pouch. My name's Fiona. When I first heard of it in China, I wasn't very scared. But then when my dad told me more about it, it caused lung failure. Nine-year-old Fiona and her family gave 400 masks to the residents and caregivers at Hearthstone at Murray Hill. I have friends and family uh, in China. Um, I heard scary stories. The people at China donated to us. Um, we decided like we had too much. So we wanted to give them out. Is there any other points that we need to make? Just because they're from China does not mean they have the coronavirus or related to it. Masks and supplies donated from members of the Chinese American Coalition have gone to places like the Harold Snitzer Center for Living, Westside Kaiser, Rose City Urgent Care, the Portland Clinic, and to TriMet. All the supplies come from Chinese families, relatives, and friends in China. The West Coast Handmade Mask Alliance has created over 1,000 masks to protect the vulnerable and those caring for them. We wanted to help out um, our community. Um, this virus is not a safe one. I don't like it at all, so we wanted to help it. The local Chinese efforts have a universal hope to limit COVID-19's power over our American homes. For my personally, I have decided not to panic anymore. We use our hands, we fight together, and that's a good feeling. Everybody should step up and unite together and help them to hold on. Uh, I hope the coronavirus disappears. I'm Steve Redlin, KGW News.